Hi guys and welcome to the Android Tutorial YouTube channel. Today we're going to check out the Google Play Store in Android TV, which is quite different from the experience that we have in uh, the cell phone or the tablet. So as you can see, first of all, I have it here. I just click on it in order to take me to it. And you got four options to the left panel, five in fact. So first of all, you got the search, then you got the home, then you got the games, my apps and settings. So I'm going to go through home first. So as you can see, I got several of the most used applications here and they're listed by features. So if you see it says featured uh, Pyongyang 2018, top paid, top free apps, TV time, movies at home, and it does show the best of each category. So that's quite cool. Um, you got featured games, so if you got a controller such as this one, which is quite cool, you're able to play um, games with it. And it has been a booming category, I can say, since the beginning of Android TV. Here you got music apps, which I don't use that much. I basically use TuneIn Music and Google Play Music. Here you got the Stay Tuned, so you're able to see um, the uh, Washington Post, Haystack, Bloomberg, all that kind of stuff. Then Sports Central, so you're able to see NFL, NBA, ESPN, all this kind of stuff. Then everyday apps, you could see Twilight, Kitchen Story, so if you want to cook and the would watch recipes on your home device you're able to do it and it says TV remote games so you're able to play very casual games here and these are the apps that you got for media music news and tools so for example for media you have this kind of layout so you could see that there are a lot of specialized apps that you're able to download in case I want to download some applications such as Kodi perhaps I'm able to click here and it will take me to this information screen so you I got the full description here and you're able to browse through it so it says uh, Kodi Media Center is an award-winning free and open source cross-platform okay so that's what I want I can flag it as an appropriate or I can install it so it's quite easy so you can see very similar to the Android app I got screenshots that I can go through and it's quite cool. Okay. Once I go back, I am I would be able to see everything on my apps. So everything will be displayed here as soon as the app is installed. Okay, so I'm not gonna go through the music, news and tools because I've done it's basically the same thing, basically the same layout. Uh, for games, there's a specialized tab. So as I'm telling you before, you're able to buy games, download games, play games, obviously, uh, emulate games here, which is not that bad. And you're able to do it as a regular console and it works really well. Um, I didn't think that the experience was so stable, but it really does play well and you got a lot of options to play then after after that one you got the my apps so as you can see first of all it's still downloading the Kodi app you could see here the updates so if I want to update something I am able to update it as simple as two clicks and it'll stop downloading and then you got all the games and the apps that you have downloaded before. So as you can see, there got our very big names such as Google Play Music, Google Play TV, Google Play Games, Facebook, which basically Facebook, I have to mention is just for video. So Facebook video, Daily Motion, Cookbook and Recipes, ABC, all that kind of stuff. All these big channels are here or applications, I mean. Um, Nest, all these are big channels that you're able to use and you're able to install. For me, it's quite cool. Something that you do have to keep in mind is that these applications are meant for Android TV. So as you can see here, it says for Android TV and a lot of them specialize for TV as this one below. Uh, that's basically because that 
application is meant to be used not with your finger but with a controller or with a d-pad and that's something that you have to keep in mind so guys if you have any questions leave it in the comment section below and if you like this video give it a thumbs up subscribe to the youtube channel that does help us a lot so that would be basically it and i'll see you on the next one bye